Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, the world away. We now got part 65 of Hashit Part Works Build the Terminator. <laughs> There we go, as promised, this is what we're going to be doing this evening. Now, we're going to be finishing the lower leg, but we're not going to be attaching it in this uh, stage. Uh, as you can see here, these are the details here. Actually, it comes in a nice brown box this time. I haven't even opened this up. Um, let's have a look, actually. I suppose that's to uh, protect all the parts. That's all we've got in there. Uh, let's open this up. It's all plastic. I can tell you that now uh, because of how light it is. But uh, it's quite a good part anyway. Look at that. The detail on that is actually... Pretty impressive. So we've got uh, this in that one. I'll show you the instructions in a minute. And we're doing exactly like we did in stage uh, 64. We've got the rod here. We've got the little metal top to go on. And then we've got those long screws. And then we've got another set of screws, uh, which are gonna attach this plate uh, to this, which we were working on last time. So let me just show you in the instructions what we are doing. Uh, we've got these here, we're gonna be putting that extra rod on, as you can see there. We're gonna be putting the uh, screw in, tighten that up, and then we're gonna be putting this plate over the top. So by the end of stage 65, we've got this probably ready to mount uh, to deter me who's still in the box underneath the table here. Now in the next part, as you can see, we're gonna be continuing uh, to build the lower right leg. Um, I'm probably wrong because I haven't seen issue 66, but I do know that a lot of you out there are up to issue 70, so, and I've seen your pictures, and the leg is definitely attached, but I don't know what issue that comes in. Uh, so this is going to be another nice quick one as well. Without further ado, let's get cracking. Okay, so just like last time, we're going to be taking this tube uh, just out of this packet here. Uh, probably going to need my trusty scalpel to help with that. Uh, but that's looking just like that. This is plastic, as I said, and this is the end that we're interested in here. Because the end for this is going to be going onto this side just here like that uh, but once again we need to open the little metal sort of like i don't know what this is like a grommet really it's stopping it wobbling around too much in there and we're going to be dropping the screw in there so i did have a spare screw from last time but i will open this pack uh, just to get another one of these screws out this is a two times 16 mil screw and all we do is put that in the end once again and then we're going to line this up just on this side here put this in through the top there and quite simply just going to screw it into place just like this it's going to take some screwing but when it's all the way in you won't be able to turn it anymore just like that and now we've got both of those on there like that then we're going to be taking this section that i showed you earlier on and as you can see we've got a whole just in this rod here we're going to line that up with the hole there so when we put this in it's going to go into this side here we're going to push it up so it's flat on the top there and we're just going to make sure we've lined up that hole here with the hole on this side because that's what we're going to actually mount this together with now before we attach any screws in here what we want to do is we want to place this detail just over the top of this into this section here now what we've got to do is it's going to be secured with a screw from the other side into this raised screw section here but the two lugs we've got here and here are going to need glue on to attach them to these sides here so i've actually just got my glue here and i'm just going to drop some glue just at the top so it runs down to the side of these lugs here so that when i put this in it's going to stay in place so i just line that up i want to make sure i line this up pretty much accurately when i put it in just like that and then when that's on it should fit flat to the leg just like that so then when i turn it upside down we can now put a screw in here to hold all of that into place now that screw is a three times eight screw they gave us two of them we only need the one so i'll load that up and we'll put that in to there and then this is going to hold this whole thing together nice and tight and then that is issue 65 complete i'm not sure if that goes on the leg yet but uh, it's almost ready to because obviously we're going to attach it to the knee joint from this section here but uh, there you go and that's all there is to do in issue 65 i said in issue 66 we do have some more details to go on the right leg i'm not sure when we're going to fit it but i know you're going to be telling me in the comments but i really do hope you like that video if you did please remember to give me a thumbs up if you haven't subscribed already do me a favor click that subscribe notification and you'll be notified every video that comes out until the next video take care